guys let's talk about the seasons now I'm not talking about the obvious winter summer well kind of autumn spring seasons but how it all relates to our work ethic and especially how it relates to corporate work ethic I find it really really funny that a lot of corporations have the busiest season or the busiest quarter at the end of the year I find it really really unproductive the reason why is this um, our ancestors most of us anyway were you know into the agriculture they were farmers so in the summer they used to do all the planting getting everything ready I'm not sure I'm not really a farmer but you know basically spending your day out on the land and in the winter obviously it got cold and you harvest and then you just basically sit at home and do much le much less farming and much more harvesting and it's not just that if you look at any animal uh, they just tend to act differently during the winter seasons because we're we as human beings have our own kind of almost seasonal energy levels so in the summer or in the spring we're full of energy we're excited we want to get out we have an outward energy so we want to you know do things we want to explore we want to invent we want to create but when you look at us during the winter our energy actually goes a lot more inward it's almost like a bit more yin rather than yang in the summer and here we should focus more on stuff like meditation reading and just honestly just relaxing and chilling out to an extent therefore I find it really really funny that a lot of uh, our corporations end up putting all the stress and it's not just corporations it's even universities and schools the end of the year happens where there are all kinds of exams and I mean I get it this has been set out in a way but maybe we should just reanalyze it I, I feel like most of the time the ideal world is a go 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 world where everyone is an A is a personality A whereas you know you're productive you're determined and you're go 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 all the time you never rest I mean how many motivational speakers have you heard of whereas you know sleep is for suckers you basically can't sleep I wake up 3 a.m. in the morning every day which is you know great but like let's be realistic what time are I gonna go to bed like 8 fair enough if you can do that and get that motivation good for you but for most people with normal jobs that's well that's a bit crazy anyway I'm not saying not to get motivated I just feel like we need to understand that seasonality affects us as people and we need to instead of working against it work with it and realize the importance of seasonality and instead of forcing ourselves to work when we're meant to rest we should rest gather our energies so we're more productive when spring comes or when summer is here it would be so fascinating if the whole world kind of operated that way whereas when the winter when the darker seasons are here people could focus more on resting have maybe shorter days and of course you're gonna even have less less sun so technically you should have shorter days during the winter so you could leave work a bit earlier enjoy a bit of sun get some vitamin D obviously there's so many people suffering from seasonal depressions because they don't have the vitamin D they need because they spend all their days in, a, in the office and by the time you're home it's already dark by that by the time how early you're leaving it's dark so you leave when, when it's dark and you come home when it's dark it just doesn't work and then you're at work and everyone's like go 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 we have numbers to make crazy anyway that's my take on seasonality